From pitches used by professional footballers to reed beds loved by birds like the bittern, with woodland, pasture and fishing for good measure. Hanson's restoration of the Middleton Hall site near Tamworth in Staffordshire has it all. The sheer extent of the variety involved in the restoration of this 470 hectare sand and gravel site is quite incredible. So too is the transformation from a previously degraded, intensively farmed landscape to one that has a huge diversity of habitats. Dating in part from Norman times, the original Middleton Hall still stands at the heart of the estate and operates as a wedding party venue. Around it, Hanson has conserved the ancient park woodland. It has also returned some of the land it has quarried to farming, with potatoes and wheat both now cropping prolifically. The football pitches have been achieved on an area that was filled with inert material and are now part of the Aston Villa training ground. But it is perhaps the impact on the valley of the River Tame that is of greatest note. Hansen worked closely with the Environment Agency on a scheme which involved experimental extraction of gravel from the riverbank. In doing so, it made possible the creation of islands, gravel bars and other features which enhanced the habitat value and improved the site's fishery. With some 23 hectares of reed beds also created in the main gravel workings, the overall benefit has been massive. I think of all the restoration aspects, we are probably most proud of the river braiding, which uh, is really a, a first for mineral extraction to have taken out the river margins which were originally being left and uh, make use of that na natural res resource of gravel as well as creating a much better habitat, improved habitat for the river. It's much a healthier river now and more natural looking with all, with all the islands and riffles and uh, rapid waters so it's oxygenating the river and improving the ecology of it. And what's more, the restoration helps to alleviate flooding in the wider area because the original floodplain now works as such, rather than simply funnelling rising water downstream to Tamworth. 